Just a couple of things. Holy shit, we're two games back in the division. I thought we were actually kind of doing well. That's odd to see. In a game back of the wild cards, even though we're not quite there yet. We're nowhere near the playoffs. But... Well, I see myself and I hear myself. That's the good news. But that means that we're locked in and live ready and recording. So welcome back in, everybody. It is the late night. It is a late night. It is the live stream Let's Play of MLB The Show 16. And we are continuing to follow and document and chronicleize this road to the show career of one Casey Braxton. Once we last left you, it was actually last night. But in the last episode, we made our way into May of 2017. Let's see. My birthday in 2017 was on a Friday. Let me tell you how good that must have been. Must have been good. 2017. What did I do on that specific birthday? Probably had to work, but then probably went out to go be an idiot. Let me honestly think. All of 2018. 20... Don't remember. Let's see. 2017. Hmm. This is 2019. Where I, As I sit here, and my birthday just hit. It's actually, uh, yeah, it's May 30th. Uh, 2019, as I sit here. Which is on a Friday. Yeah. Oh, well, whatever. I don't fucking know. Doesn't matter. Let's play some baseball, goddammit. Milwaukee, the White Sox, and Oakland, if I remember right, is the three teams we gots to be facing. Oh, one thing I also did just check a little bit, um... Oh, and ju just for argument's sake, user settings, someone had a question, gameplay options, pitching veteran, there, alright, this is what I had those 10 strikeouts in the one game, it's like, I don't think that was legit, I'm like, it's legit, <clears throat> trust me, mm. hoo hoo, alright, I need about two grand, two grand to get there, we'll get that before the episode's done, but uh, no, I was gonna check some league leaderage, um, uh, wins, well, I mean, I got, what, four, which is technically tied for fourth in the league. Where in the hell? Thought I had, no, four. God damn it all. I wish they would, like, light up my name. There, Casey Braxton, there we go. James Shields, where did he come from? San Diego, Kansas City, I think he won the, uh, I was doing good there. In Tampa Bay, back in the day. Nick Carrington is in the house. Welcome in, Nick to the live stream let's play it is a late night live stream let's play of mlb the show 16 about to start up here losses check that out haven't lost a game yet had a couple of no decisions but i haven't lost a game yet saves era oh uh, yeah i'm in the 160 yeah 169 170 look at that sixth in the league wait no that's just the national league god damn it i want all of baseball see where i'm at 160 dude all the best pitchers are in the National League. Good thing I'm here. Because in the American League, you're facing DHs instead of fucking pitchers. Look at that. 181 is the best. We have... Jesus, one, two... We have eight pitchers that are equal or better. Good God. Score is 49-59 Raptors. Where is Hitman at? Hitman will be coming up eventually. Um... I didn't want to start playing Hitman 2 tonight, because then tomorrow's Friday night, and uh, there's a little to-do that I might go and check out, so I probably don't stream tomorrow night. And Saturday night, there's something to do, so I don't, won't stream Saturday night. Maybe during the day. Uh, Sunday, I'll probably stream during the day. But um, even still, I'll probably go jump out, grab some, uh, like, a late late brunch early dinner with some friends and then i gotta work early monday morning so uh i wouldn't want to give you know just here's some hitman 2 and then it's a long delay till the second episode i wouldn't want to necessarily do that um especially like an intro episode uh hell no I, I would want that first episode to be a little a little meaty a little time consuming might do it saturday although i, I might go to the beach or something On sunday I might start it, but Monday is almost a better time, because I'll be home around 2 p.m. Eastern time, um, and I you know, might get home and do a workout. I have to work the early shift. I have to be there at 5 a.m. on Monday, and I'll get home around 2, maybe do a workout, shower up. Let's say we're starting up and streaming and recording by 4 p.m. Eastern. That's a good chunk of time, because then I'll have all the remainder of Monday afternoon and night to be streaming if need be. So Sunday, possibly Monday is a good start time for that. That would be a good chunk of time. Because normally, if I sit here, it's a little after 10 o'clock. 
So 10, 11, 12, 1 in the morning. It's about the time I go to bed. This is about a three hour window that I have. So something like this works a little better on that note. Um, well, actually, a couple things that I just wanted to show out here. Walks allowed. One walk allowed. Although, Tehran. 46 innings pitch. He's pitched more innings. Three walks. Amazing. I have a whip of 0. 0. 0.82. Excuse me. Pitching war. Second best. And I would be the best in the American League. But still, pitching wins above replacement. Second best in the league. Good God. But I'm very proud of that. Anyway. Thanks so much, Nick. That's where uh, that's where the Hitman thing is kind of sitting right now. That's my odd. That's my ideal. Possibly Sunday, but Monday looks like there's a big chunk of time there. Now Monday is going to be weird because although, um, you know, I'll get home and probably get a workout done then and all that bullshit. Because that's uh, I'll have to wake up at like three o'clock in the morning to get myself going to work. I might be dog dead tired Monday. I might not stream much of anything. Just because my sleep schedule will be fucking way off and, you know, I'll just be tired as shit. Now, it's not a guarantee for Monday. Chicago Sunday Cup. looks pretty good. But, uh, that's what I would look for, at least for an initial episode, is a big chunk of time. So, that's kind of where I'm thinking that that's going to be. So, just a heads up. Kind of like that guy's hat up there. Blue dome with a red brim. That was kind of cute. Fucking Scooter Jeanette. Alright, well, let's get back to the mound. Get our three-game minimum taken care of. Leading See the shoulder the patch there? That little that MB, that, that cartoon fielding glove? That's the, that's the hat that I have. That dark blue with that logo. I don't like the M with the fucking barley grain wheat whatever the fuck. I don't like that look, honestly. I just don't. Not like I get it, like it's, you know, brewers, you gotta have like the wheat, the grain, whatever the fuck it is, the barley, the hops. I just don't like that look. Like even my brewer's hat, I had to order it online, sadly, and it's a bit of a snug fit, even though it is a seven and a half. Ball inside. Gotta get that first pitch strike and we're fucking up already. God damn, look at this guy. That's foul. Yeah, I love how I run away because the camera shifts. Some bitch. Come on. Bad pitch. Get under it. Thank you. Not the conventional way to get all these outs, but goddamn it, I got to get them. Only four home runs for Ryan Braun, and we're kind of in the early to mid set of May. <laughs> Yeah, you stop taking steroids, you're not MVP caliber anymore, are you? Huh. Ah. <laughs> you got caught too soon, Braun. He should have just come out and said, yeah, maybe there's something in that, uh, yeah. Yeah. It's like, I understand, here, here in the America, the United States, we, we love a good, you know, sap ass story like that and forgiveness the people will forgive you just be honest I don't know how Ryan Braun like they still love him in Milwaukee I'm like don't this guy's a fucking cheat ass snake like you would not want him to represent your team oh great that's the steroids that's how you got that double he's safe fucking he's juicing batting four Dex, I can't be mad. Chris Carter. Carter. Gotta give the finger dance move. God, what is with my brother? Excited delirium. Nope, that's a Wow, ball. I gotta hit my spots, yo. Ball one, no strike. Told you it's on veteran. Ah! Ah. Hey. I mean, that did hit, but he kind of gave me that one. He kind of, kind of halfway did. Time to take a seat. No damage done despite the uh, two out double. Psalm bitch. Huh. Looks like Nick is still in the house. What's going on, Nick? How are you? What's going on? Tell me something good. Look at that RBI double. And we got the lead here in the first. That's good. 
Leading off for the Brewers, Sean Stacy. Center fielder, Sean Stacy. It's also interesting. I plan on playing a long career here. I did 12 years with Derek Metzger. 12 seasons. From age 18 to age 30. Could have got a lot more mileage out of that. How much, I don't know. Another, like, 10 years would have been tremendous. Ball inside. But, you know, even to get to, like, 35 would have been great. Two balls. Trying that Two power strike. swing and just couldn't fucking let up. Couldn't fucking do it. That's weak enough to be hit the shortstop. Good Got liner it. throw. Not that low shit that might skip in the dirt. Not that too much. Good throw. Right Just fielder. fucking get it. Pick it up and Brian throw it to him. Gonzalez. That's all you gotta do. Ah. Yeah, I did say Hitman 2, and somewhere in my brain, I'm like, you know what? There's other... I got so many games on the back burner right now. I don't want to, like, spoil and give a list, but, I mean, Jesus Christ, there's enough. That's gone. Son of a bitch. I'm not hitting my spots, but they're hitting the ball. God damn it, now we're tied. Son of a bitch. Batting seven, third baseman, Garen Shakini. I don't know about throwing the same pitch in the same spot to start the attack. Ball, yeah, brush him off, that's cool. What's the next one? There we go. Hey, give us something new here, huh? Ah, fuck. The count is two and one. Like half blink, that's, that's me. I'll let you know when I throw a bad one, and so far all these, they that's haven't been good. Down is three and one. Three one, son of a fuck. Aye. Well, that was terrible, Full but he count. didn't take three a hack two. at it. Nope. Wow, camera, let's look that way. Oh, motherfucking down the line, fair bullshit. Fuck you, game. God damn it. Batting in here. Catch it. Jason Hunt. I am not hitting my spots for shit. I'm way off. Slapper. All right, so this is out, too. He's Thank out. You. All right, let's get this guy. Get this batter. And he'll be over. The pitcher, number 26, Taylor Hey. All right, get, yeah, let's, let's get some confidence. Let's get the fucking... Aye. Ho, ho, all right, come on. Not down, though. Ball that's outside. Not down, you dumb fuck. Had he punched that down the opposite field line. I'm going up. Going against the fucking catcher's wishes, I'm telling you, that upper right corner is the best spot for the cutter when they already got two strikes on them. Just trust me on this. Hmm. Nobody on, and here comes my 176 bat mass. Not good, I admit that. Catcher, Casey Braxton. Oh, I'm going for it. Huh. Cut off, ah, uh, fuck. Couldn't quite get the split. Batting ninth. Second yeah, but there's two outs. He's going to have to make a hell of a hit to get my ass on. Hey, just clear the fucking fence, would you? Just do that. Ball match outside. That was a decent hit. I know, it was the first pitch, Mike. Why would you go after that? I know, I know. But hey, I was on it. I know that's one of my golden rules that I break all on my own. Ball two. Why is Three he balls, doing like the, the speed, the stretch pitch? I'm not gonna steal no, with safe. my speed of two. There's no fucking way. That's ball three. They're just gonna Three walk balls, him up, man. Well, Zobers, you, you kind of got, uh, oh, whatever. Oh, why can't we get the perfect shot down the baseline, huh? Stand up double. Ball four, take the base. 
Poor jump. Well, yeah. That's not a steal of second base, quite honestly. It's just not. I wasn't even thinking for that. I mean, I should have been moving earlier. One step. That's all I'm doing. And hey, we're swinging at the first. Dude, if you swing at the first thing and you miss that late, like you're not, you're clearly not ready to, to fucking hit it. Ball inside. See, now a solid base hit and my ass is home, so that's all right. I got to count one and two. Whiff it by him. Actually, just burn it by him and he'll whiff. That, that's what I meant. I got to count two and two. I mean, let's, let's not have this go. I hate this. Fuck it, just run. Just run. He'll drop it. Or not. Son of a bitch. All right, come on. Get me back on the mound. We're tied up here. Let's go. Fucking Scooter. Every goddamn team in the league needs a goddamn guy named Scooter. Scooter Jeanette. Yeah, look at that opposite field hit. Look at that. That's nice. I mean, I'm glad it's only a fucking base hit. Let's look at that double play, but still, cheap. it's just Shortstop. cheap. Jonathan Beyond. Huh. Uppercut blast. Um. Okay, I was gonna say, how far is that thing going, huh? Wait, second, third. Where are you going? Where are you going? The left fielder, number eight, Ryan Braun. Ball. Oh. Do. Counts that one dropped and enough. But still, it's one of those, is he going to try the golf shot, you know? Oh, solid to center. Solid to center. Thank you. Put him back, put him back, put him back. All right, so we didn't get the double play, but it's only a man on first. The first baseman, number 33. The strikeouts Chris ain't happening. Carter. Yeah, sneak that one back in. That was beautiful. That would have been a great third strike. One ball, one strike. That was shit. Oh, the count missed the spot one by two. almost a foot there. I mean, he swung and missed it, but still. Oh, Carter got him. There goes Chris Carter. <laughs> Touchdown when he hits a home run. I, yeah, it's fucking weird like that. Two outs. A walk. Three outs. Super. What happened there? Something, uh, Fowler out at second. Fernandez grounds into a force out, follows out. Okay, I got you. Um, top of the fourth, I think. Fowler walks Fernandez, so I'll be the number two batter. That's what I'm looking at. Okay. One to one here. Leading off for the Brewers. Center fielder, Sean Stacy. Ah. Ah. Sean Stacy as opposed to Sean Casey. Ah. Former big time slugger for the uh, Cincinnati Reds. One ball. The Reds Two's had right. like that power three lineup. And this goes back. I'm talking like because of MVP baseball like 2003. Check me if I'm wrong on the roster there. Sweeper, he's gone. But it was Adam Dunn, Sean Casey, and Austin. Ryan. Austin Gonzalez. Barnes, Austin Kearns, Austin Carnes, something like that. Damn it. It's like they were like three power-hitting sons of bitches. I'm like, how does this team lose? And apparently their pitching was just the hey. shits. But Adam Dunn, I know he was a strikeout guy. But Adam Dunn and Sean Casey and Austin Kearns. Like the three of them, like they were pretty fucking good on the home runs. Looks like it's time to start ringing up some strikeouts. Well, that's about third, maybe fourth. Now batting, 
And coming into this episode today, I did have more strikeouts than innings pitched, which is great. That's what I want for the season, for every season. Oh. Ball inside. It's all right. It's all right. We'll we'll get him. We will get him. Down, Chopper, with that weak shit. Go get him. He's out. There you go. And just that quick. Well, they got four hits to our three. Lead off nothing. All right, now I'm batting 222. If I get it, I'll go for it. Up four. Catcher. Casey. Nope. All right. Braxton. Hey. Curveball, somewhat middle low. Um, four up. Okay. Ball left outside. Changer out. All right. Four up. Come on. Don't be scared. Damn it. Ah. Two seamer in. That I was got the count. very One and two. Fuck. Um. Curveball down. Nope. Shit, 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 shit. Why? It's like, as it's flying at me, I'm like, I can't hit that. Out. Now, I used the circle button just for contact, but goddamn, that was pathetic, huh? Fly out, nothing doing. Damn it. We're in the fifth inning. I got 53 pitches going. Leading out for the Brewers. No, I was also thinking gotcha. tonight I was going to jump back Jason into FIFA 19. Punk. Like that, that game I'll probably never ever finish. If I finish one season, like I'd be very impressed with myself. Because I don't play that in one my one. off time. So I'm gonna play that uh, that player career. I just remembered my guy's name, Dylan Lancaster. Kinda like that name. It's got a very British ring to it. Being there from the Cayman Islands. Sounds right. Sounds legit. The pitcher number 26, Taylor Youngman. Yeah! Yeah. Started off a little bit rough for us, but... Feeling like the groove is getting better right now. There's the spot, son. Nope. The bad thing okay. is I threw shit, but... Okay. Oh! Alright, yeah, from mid to up is fine. I do prefer the upper right. But if it's like middle row, on that right side, I lean this way, even though I know it's on that side of the screen. But it's mirrored, you know, whatever, leave it be. Please, please. 1-0. Thunk. That was fucking dirt, yo. That was fucking dirt. Ball match outside. Just a bad one. Just a bad one. Get a strike going here. Aye! Aye! Come on. Flying it out. Flying it out. Catchable, catchable. Oh. No, that's a foul ball! I don't know about this outside on a lefty. Because it's going to come back in, and that's twice he's got the opposite field punch here. All right? Stop that shit, you dumb fucking catcher piece of crap. Oh, look, lucky Apple. pulled it, and luckily it's foul. Not down. This catcher's a fucking idiot, you know? Really is. Catcher is a fucking idiot. Outside coming back in, outside coming back in, outside coming back in. There we go, there's the lead. A walk, Bryant. Ah, strike out. Fly out, no advance. Damn it. I'll be the number two batter. And here I am thinking like, oh, well, I want to be a good Brewers. batting pitcher. Short I am not, by the way. Jonathan Dion. I want to help my cause, I was saying. I mean, last season I started, I think it was like on beginner batting. I mean, I hope to God it's on rookie right now, but even still, I suck. I mean, y'all have seen me do much better batting. You have. There's just something I'm doing way off here. Bryant? Good fucking. Yes, better him to do that than me. 
I would have not had an angle with that. Well, even if I had, wouldn't have had the arm for it, running the direction I was. Great play by Brian. Hey, every little bit helps, man. You struck out with two men on. Three! Ooh, cutter outside, and there goes the Hebrewer. The first baseman, number 33. Who's Jewish? Hebrew? Chris the Hebrewer? Carter. You get that? Come on. That is a clever nickname, though. I thought they called him the Hebrew Hammer. Maybe I just heard that out of my own brain. <laughs> oh! But I thought I've heard that before. A one pitch out, I'll take that, too. Strikeouts are a little scarce right now. Nothing heavy going. Hey, Anthony goes with some insurance there. Here I am batting two of them. Okay, up next four up. Got it. Got to try it. Casey nope. Braxton. Aye. Four seamer. That one tended to. That looked like it had a little bit of movement going for it. Damn it. Ah, that looked nice. Fuck, man. Curve down or four up. Change up down. Guess not. Well. He'll do it again. Or not. Four in. Thought that thing was going down. Four up. Mm. Damn it. <laughs> that was that perfect Derek Jeter, like, off the bat, the, the opposite field, but 18. nothing on it. Double for Hayward, nothing, okay. Still got me in. 75 pitches in the seventh. Leading off for the Brewers, center fielder, Sean Stacy. Yeah, I just don't feel like my batting is anything to really look good at. I hope in the long run I can kind of be a contender. Oh, nice pickup. Wow, oh. you could have planted your feet a little better, but what a throw. How about it? Helping me out. Right fielder. Brian. Six and a third Gonzalez. with eight strikeouts. Holy fuck. All right. Still ahead of the game. I saw what he did. You know how unimpressed I was? Oh, one's the count. He's swinging at 85 mile an hour cutters. Like that, that's where he's at right now in life. Ah! 84 mile an hour cutters. Mm. Ball inside. Oof. That's nine. That's good enough for a fucking complete game. Or whatever that staff line was, I don't know. But I'm just motoring Aaron through. Shakini. Motor boating through. Down shop. Ah, uh, he sat on it at least. It's all right. Not ideal, but it's not that Jason fucking Hunt. split that gets a double. You know. Ball that outside. Yep, yep. Trying that that quick pitch. Doing out. Yeah, but I gotta hit the zone now. God damn it. Oh, pull shot. That's a strike, though. Nope. Huh. That was rip off city right there. Pull shot. Foul ball. All right, all right, all right, all right. We got him. We got him. There's two outs. We got him. God fucking damn it. Bullshit. Oh, he didn't even go to third. I am shocked. Fucking opposite field bullshit. Yeah, pull me out now. That's great, Skip. You're a fucking idiot, Skipper. You're a fucking idiot, Skipper. You're a fucking idiot, Skipper. God damn it. Yeah, it's another earned run against me. Bullshit. Oh, come on, I don't get that many complete games. You got four other pitchers to fucking 
Get the bullpen rotation going around. Yeah, double bullshit because a perfect fucking run right down the third baseline. Bullshit. When this game doesn't want you to do well, you won't. Yeah, at least we're getting some good late insurance. I don't know if this win will end up going to me, though. Yeah, because now, 8-2. to two. What happened there? Another out and hit by pitch. What the fuck are they doing? That's 10. That's 11. Hey, finally out there. That was eight runs in the bottom of the eighth. That, that's pretty good insurance right there. That was pretty good insurance. Jason Hayward, three hits, only one RBI, though. Huh. I mean, he well, he scored two runs. Scored two and brought in another. That's accountable for three. That's pretty good. Now, that eighth inning was a blow-up. And that puts me to 5-0. and oh. Here now is the... And I had at least nine strikeouts. Yep, in seven and two-thirds. So, still... Doing better with strikeouts versus, uh, well, you know, Michael Fires. Five win streak, a quality start, and win 400 points. That's going to be so close. 1914, are you kidding me? Seven points shy. Can I just take out a loan <laughs> and I'll pay you back? Well, let's save anyway. You know what would have helped? Getting out of that fucking inning, Skipper. Rip me off. Absolutely rip me the fuck off. The only thing that's, like, noticeable of, like, oh, Joe Madden's a fucking weird genius. Um, fuck, hold on a second. Let me, let me get the difficulty. Just in case they squeak one on me. Veteran, uh, beginner pitching. Okay, apply. Beeler, get the win. Alright, so we win two out of three. Day off. The Pirates trade uh, catcher Elias Diaz of the Cubs for Dustin Ackley and Carson Blair. I don't know who they are. Arietta at the Mets. Loss. Lester. Mets. Loss. Kashner. Mets. We get fucking swept. Pathetic. And that was Steven Strasburg. Holy shit. Veteran pitching. Apply. Uh, and I'll save it right there. That was Steven Strasburg for the fucking White Sox. Who should also have Chris Sale, if I know correctly. Actually, they should, unless he split after last season. After my rookie season. Yeah, that ain't gonna be fun. Not at all. God damn it. And plus, well, this is a road game, so I don't even take my at-bats. Huh. 49 and a third with 54 strikeouts. He has what? 49 with 48. Okay. Play the next appearance, which is right now. Two games above 500. We need to start stringing together some fucking W's here, people. This ain't good. This ain't good at all. Been kind of busting my ass with some workouts recently. I've been upping my... I, you know, sticking with my workouts. Got that DDP yoga going. Oh, yeah. Yes, I got it going. And it's raining, of course. But, uh... Um, less running around before work, and I've been able to do, like, one-hour-long workouts. Instead, I would do, like, 30, 45-minute kind of long workouts. But, um, I've been doing about hour-long workouts, and it's like, I, I want to... I saw a picture recently, I don't know if I talked about this. Um, MLB on Twitter posted up a picture of Mike Trout, who basically is a linebacker playing baseball. He's a fucking... he's just a horse. He's solid. Just a big fucking dude who, you know... He looks unreal out there. Almost looks like he's on the gas like Conseco, you know, back in the day. But anyway, regardless, uh, he was wearing a shirt that MLB took a picture of, and it said, always sore, like from working out. And that just hit me like, okay, I get that, and I should I should apply that to myself. Leading because like, I, right I would do my workouts, and sure, okay, there's a calorie one. burn, and oh, I'm working on, you know, Eaton. range of motion and, you know, the stretches and all that shit. But it's like, I'm not, I'm not sore, I'm not hurting oh, from my workout, so like, is that even effective then? Like, I should be like, oh god, my legs, you know, yoga, you do not skip a leg day with yoga. Ball, that you really side. don't. Because you're always going to be doing something. 
I like Adam Eaton here. This kid, pretty fucking good, at least in this game. Real life, I don't know, but... Solid enough for me to, like, tip of the cap and hate him at the same time. Now, I don't know. Th this has changed. I don't even think it's U.S. Cellular feeling anymore. I don't know what the corporate smear name is. Perfect timing, not on the spot. So now down he'll try. Mm -hmm. Well... Up has missed. All over his fucking head. Damn it. Yeah, a long at bat, and he gets on base. That sucks. Batting second, right fielder, Sam Valencia. Don't trust him. Ball that I didn't miss by that much. That's bullshit. Yep. Ball two. Got him. Thank He's God. Out. All right. Got the man out, but it's a 2-0 count right now. Ah. Terrible. I mean, that, that thing should be sailing right now. Ah, fuck. Gap shot. Gets there. Nicely done. Thank you. Rough that start already. Fair. Jose Abreu is supposed to be a Jose. fucking stud Abreu. and a half. And maybe his numbers are still good, but the White Sox stink, so I don't see his name. I don't hear about him for nothing. Oh, no. I can't hit shit right now. Well, sorry, I can't hit the strike zone. <laughs> okay. Oh. Yeah. Hey, got out of the inning. That was the bottom of the first, so first inning is over. I don't get any at-bats here, so I got to rely on the boys now. Force out at second. Fly out. Walk. Mmm, nothing. All right. It's all me here. This is an American League game. And See, why does Todd up. Frazier, like, look Third at his gloves. Baseman. He's got just Tom black and white gloves. Frazier. Why are there so many guys here on the White Sox? They have, like, that tennis ball kind of glowing green. Mainly with their gloves. Is that a brand-specific no thing, or is that, like, a weird quasi-alternate color that the fucking White Sox use, and I have no zero clue about. Doesn't matter now to Frazier. He can go take a timeout. Sit for a while. Batting fifth. Catcher. Deanna Navarro. Deanna Navarro. Played for the Blue Jays back on MVP Baseball 2005. Yep, I referenced that game a lot. I loved it. It was for the PS2. But I thought it was one, it was just a beautiful baseball game. It really was. Ball that Had a side. lot of fun. Well, I played 03, 04, and 05, but, you know, because I didn't pick up a PS3 for the longest time, uh, that game alone was hey. really just keeping me just playing video ball, games, strikes, even though I was way behind the times. What the two fuck ball, was that? Two strikes. Other than way out there. Let's get him. We got full count. Fuck. Fuck your full count. Uppercut shot. Well, I'm running around. Okay, he's under it. Perfect. Oh. Or they're working the count. Batting six. Second Brett baseman. Lowry. Brett Lowry. Lowry. Okay, fine. I tell you, you look like hey. Brett Lowry. That little bat waver when the recoil's coming on the fucking meter. Riz, thank you. Thank you. Simple but effective. Zobrist, are we top of the order already? No, not quite, but... Base hit, fly out, strike out, walk, strike out. Damn it. It's like we'll get a guy on first, the next guy walks, and then there's and your third out. for the White Sox. Left fielder... Melky Cabrera. Fucking hey. Milkman. So he's got like that fucking look at the color on his gloves there. He's got like that tennis ball neon yellowish green kind of. I don't know why that stands out to my brain more with specifically the White Sox. I know other team players have that, but 
It just seems like there's a bulk of White Sox players who have it. Enough of them to make me realize it. Wow. On perfect timing, that curveball's in the motherfucking seats. Bullshit fuck you game. Yeah, perfect curveball, huh? Perfect, perfect timing. Designated hitter, Glenn Ball inside. God damn it. And we're down one to nothing. One ball, uh, one Perfect strike. timing, fucking Milky. Jesus Christ. Have I ever mentioned that when this game strike. doesn't want you to do well, you just won't? It's fucking bullshit. Alright, get him. Riz? No way. Diving, no less. Like these goddamn Lynn Swan or some spot. bullshit. Eric Ibar. Eric Ibar, where did he come from? I don't know why my brain is thinking Atlanta, but uh, I, I could be wrong, more than likely is the case. Ball inside. Dude, that wasn't that bad of a pitch. I mean, you let that bounce past you. Mr. Catcher guy. Somebody else get that. That ain't me. All right. Um, oh, we're not out yet. The center fielder. Adam Eaton's one, got those gloves. Eaton. Cabrera's got those gloves. Who oh, get that. Get that. There you go. One pitch out, and come on, boys. Strike out. Bullshit. Bullshit. Great. That's fun. Back to the mound. Leading off the fourth inning, right fielder, Sam hey. Valencia. Hey. And shit. You know. Well, good. Strike two. Come on. Chop shot, playable, easy. Toss. There Easy's you out. go. Oh, yeah, the way the strikeouts the are kind of evading me today. Oh, Plus, they're winning the I'll game. Fuckers. Yeah! Wow, that missed by at least a foot. And I was damn near on the fucking target. See, now that was oh, bad, inside. and it didn't miss by that much. I don't get this game. The consistency is so fucking weird. I mean, I would say the movement of my pitches is fine. The velocity is decent. I might up the cutter, and that that would be the only thing. Ball that jumps on. Mm. Fuck. Okay. That was like in a perfect spot where it ended. Oh boy. Damn. Come on. Full shot, oh, thankfully right. foul. Gotta get this guy out. What do you, what do you, come on. Come on now. Let's get him. Sweeping curveball. He's out. I mean, that was a handcuffer. He could have let that go. Doubt it would have been called a strike, but he missed. Third baseman, number 21. And that's in that spot where, God damn it, you, you kind of have to attack at it. Hey. I mean, the umps, oh, one. last game and this game... So far, good. Had one little rip one and off. One. I don't know, that, that was late in the game. There was one pitch I thought was definitely an eighth, well, not eighth inning, sorry. Aye. My last inning, second to last inning. One pitch, I was like, come on. Damn. God phrase you. Well, if we knock him out, Nope, nope, not like that. Just get under it, please. Come on, boys, help me out here. Not like that, not like that, not like that. Motherfucker. Fifth inning, 52 pitches. And leading off for the White Sox. Catcher, Deanna Navarro. Oh, no strike. Well, Deanna Navarro looks like a well-fed kid, doesn't he?
Oh boy, speed of 16, you better not make it. Perfect down the fucking baseline though. Perfect the punch. Number 15, second baseman, Brett Laurie. Great. Playable. That's one. Huh. I mean, yeah, one pitch out, but. Mm. The left fielder, number 53, Melky Cabrera. Hey. Yeah, so let's, he hit a, hit a fucking curveball home run last time, so let's start throwing him curveballs again, huh? No ball. I mean, that is the handcuff. Come on. No, God damn it. I say. Time out. That ball got him. Perfect. Oh, Jesus Christ. Now batting. Designated hitter, Glenn Spoon. Hey! And only one out, so the double play very imperative now. The count. Oh, he oh, was two. late on that one. Mm. Damn. Huh. Bad, bad pitch, but an even worse swing. The batter number seven, shortstop, Eric Ayer. Yeah, that missed up by, you know, plenty. Down chop, any out to good out. Thank He's you. Out. Inning over. Come on, guys, get on base, do something. A walk, that's fair. Double play, not so good. There's another walk. There's a hit that drives in a run, ties it up. Okay, okay. Three hits apiece, one run apiece. And leading off for the White I Sox. nailed Melky Cooper. I didn't mean to. Adam Fuck. That's just up there. If I wanted to hit Melky Cabrera, I would have done it early in the at bat. But no point to. We're down one to nothing. That's up next stupid. for the White Sox. What are you showing me, Cole? What is this? Three Sam strikeouts and five Valencia. and third. That's not good. Three. Wrong pitch. Fuck it. Just go with it. He wanted the sweeper. I went 12 to 6. One pitch, one out. The first baseman, number good snag. Damn good snag. Jose Abreu. Damn it. Deep, but still, just the fact that they get solid hits like that pisses me off. Was that three pitches, three outs? I don't think so. Huh. Sixth inning, one pitch fly out, one pitch line out, one pitch fly out. Yeah. Holy shit, there you go. Three pitches, three outs in this uh, bottom of the sixth inning. I'm sorry, in that bottom of the sixth. Not this one, the other one. So there you go. That's, that's something very unique. Three pitches, three outs. That's not easy to come by. Ah! Huh. Well, there you go. Yeah, the deep fly, the liner when I through the wrong pitch type and then the deep fly to center okay works for me that's just that's a unique thing to have three pitches three outs that's uh, that's nice I mean that right there took three pitches now to get one guy out where's the efficiency the honor Navarro downward chopperoo I think the next game, I forgot, uh, oh God, is it Cincinnati? No, the uh, it's Oakland. Ball Oakland inside. we got coming up next for my next Stizzard. Down chop, and you going ground out. Out number out. two. Decent done. Yeah, three pitches. Wish it was a strikeout. I wish. Russell, you got a little bit of glove work today. Right. He had that uh, second out in the last inning. Nice little dive job.
Oy. Fuck. I mean, he was slow walking to it. I'll take the one pitch out, but goddamn. They're, they're getting under the ball pretty heavy right now. Damn. It's like we're not even working the count here. Not even getting around. Solo home run and got beamed. And leading off for the White Sox. Left fielder. Nope, that's a ball. Herrera. Counts 1-0. Hey. hey. Why the cutter that comes into him? That was a bad pitch. If that one hit the seats, I mean, that's all me. That ain't the game being cheap. That was just a bad throw. But then there's that curveball that he loves to hit. Let's let him get underneath that one, too. Jesus Christ. They're, they're like, really uppercutting the shit out of this thing today. Not Alabama. good for business. Designated hitter, Glenn I would imagine this is probably my last set here is this fucking eighth inning. One more man on base. Hey! And I'm probably uh, getting pulled. Because that earned run would then be mine if it is. Hey! Up. I got the count. Oh, and two. It's okay. This is okay. Damn. Down chop. Easy play. He's out. Addison, the muscle Russell. Showing some good glove today. Seven, oh, just that one catch. I know. Eric one catch. Who so gives a shit? One fuck center fielder's been running his ass off out there. Hey. Oof. I mean, you know, that was split on the line, but just that overall up and in curveball where it ended was beautiful. More action for Russell. Get him out. Let's go. Strikeout. There's a walk. Nothing. Nothing. God damn it. Rex Brothers walks the first guy. One out. Two outs. Three outs. Okay. Extra innings. Hit. Walk. And, oh, you got to do something here. Play at the plate. Got the run somehow. All right, one comes in, two comes in, four to one. All right, good cushion. Strike out, out two, out three. I don't think I get the win because it was tied. No, I shouldn't get the win at all. Shouldn't get the win at all. Should be brothers. They want to say that I was player of the game material. I kind of disagree with that, but... Uh... If they think four strikeouts in eight innings is good, it's only three hits allowed. That's honestly not bad. Yeah, Rex Brothers with the win. That's what I figured. That's what I figured. Yeah, four strikeouts. Just felt like my consistency wasn't good. Boy, I love that. The sixth inning. Zero balls, three strikes, and inning over. <laughs> Quality start. 292. Um, well, you know me. Said I was going to do this right the fuck away, so H9. Yeah, let's do that. HR9, what's that going to cost me? 16. Okay. Wow. Um, yeah, HR9, that's, that's still kind of biting us, so I'll need 1620 at that rate. Now, the H9, it's at 85 with the 5 booster. That's technically at a 90. Um, quick save. Well, let's do the dip and save. You know, this is the dip. The uh, beginner pitching. Apply. Then we'll go save because we might have that training session before the next game. If not, put it back and we gotta deal with Oakland. Coming up. I mean, I'm, I'm still undefeated. <laughs> Two game, White Sox set there. Pitch command, enter training. We had the loss there, so the road set of two, we lose, and then it's going to be a home set. I've had water sitting here. Let's take a sip of that already. Two games into it. Needed that. Fuck, i got to get some food prepped up for tomorrow, too. Okay. That was terrible. That's all right. We, we got we got a ways to go here. Got 19 more to, to rack up. 
Jeez, this is on beginner. I'm looking like shit. Maybe I'm just off today. Just hit the target, Mike, and you will be fine. Yeah, movement on my pitches, not such a worry. I'm, I'm more concerned with uh, control in the long run. Now, I wonder cosmetically, like, is that just for a visual? Because I'm not looking to, like, paint the corner with, like, a fucking, you know... I, I kind of want it to be like Greg Maddox, but I picture myself to be, I don't know, just like a... A lot of movement. Like, Jamie Moyer had these long fucking winding sweep throws, you know? I forgot, was it Mets, Cardinals? What? No, that was uh, Glavin, excuse me. No, but that, okay, no, maybe that's what I'm thinking of. Albert Pujols was uh, saying like, oh, well, he's pitching garbage, he's pitching, he's not, not a good pitcher. You know, his shit wasn't doing anything. Yeah, it's because you lost. And then the next time they faced each other and the Cardinals won, Pujols like, no, no, he had good stuff tonight. It's like, well, come on, you were just angry because he throws fucking 30 miles an hour and you couldn't fucking hit it. I want to say that was Glavin. Then this goes back, I don't know what fucking year, 2003, 2004, uh, because I want to say that I was already living in Orlando at the time, so 2005, 2006, somewhere around there. Wait, I don't need all these pitches, now I got my fucking gold. Let's just pile on. Let's just smother it. Yeah, I wonder if raising up your pitch control really does anything. Because, like, H9, K9, like, that's the shit you want to worry with. That's the stuff that really fucking matters. Do they hit it? Do they get good contact on it? I mean, like, oh, I put my pitch in the perfect spot. Well, yeah, but if they're looking for it, they're going to fucking mash it anyway. You can be on your game, and they just fucking hit the shit out of it. I'd rather... Like I said, I got my canine raised up pretty fucking good. I'd say we're doing pretty good with everything. Now that I just raised up H9, like, okay. Like, that's really good. Arietta and Lester. So we split all together. It's a four-game set against the White Sox. Two on the road, split. Two at home, split. Son of a bitch. All right. Kashner here. That's a win. All right, so... 58 strikeouts in 57 and a third, so let's get to beginner, rookie, veteran pitching. All right, apply and save, and let's go into goddamn Oakland. Or sorry, let's play Oakland. We're, we're home on this one. See, now they, they got to do National League rules. Senior circuit, motherfucker. What was that training for that shit? 1,600. Yeah, I'm nowhere near it. Could get that rate, but I don't know. I, I don't really walk people, so it almost doesn't matter. What are these things that I have a... Second wind, moderate boost energy when you start to get tired. That's helpful right now, that is. Shut it down, no steal attempts will occur. Oh, that's the 60 right there, because I'm thinking like, hmm. I got this raise, I can do some of this. Increase velocity for the at-bat. What? fucking good is that gonna do ah pitch break affects how much a specific pitch breaks moves or curves control how accurate a pitcher can throw a, sp a specific pitch yeah I think that's just on your fucking accuracy meter I, I don't think that's th has anything to do with you know this 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 these this is your money right here with pitching this is this is where you're gonna make your fucking dollars Ooh, I need 2,500 for that shit. Frozen. Hitter will not swing. Like I said, I use that late in the game. Um, Boy, smooth hands would be great. 85. Wow, that's a lot of fucking points. bb is the last one I'm worried about of this set. I'd rather get pitching clutch up there to like 80 or fucking 90 would... 90 would be 2,900 points. Are you kidding me? BB9 to go to 85. 
Now, I know it's a bigger jump, but 74.65? You're fucking kidding me. Wow. Shoo. Well, there's that look at things. Anyway, um, let's play this game. With my newly renovated H9 stat. Newly renovated. Anyway, let me, um... The game started late tonight. Uh, NBA Finals Game 1. Golden State and Tarana. Guess they're still playing. Toronto's got to play physical. They're leading 103 to 94. 103 to 94 with about still over five minutes left in the game. Never count out Golden State. They'll just get on a run. 3-3-3-3-3, three, 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 and you're like, fuck, now we're down by 6. Just up by 9, 10, 11 points. Billy Burns. Leading off tonight for Oakland. Center field. Joe Dumbass. Number 1. one -oh. Yep, get them off the plate on the first pitch. Just, just fucking make them make move. Yeah, honestly, never been to Wrigley. Honestly, the first baseball game I went to was actually down here in fucking Miami. When the Marlins were still playing at the football state at the Dolphin Stadium. Yeah. That was a little warm out that day. Damn. We got under that one. That's shallow though. Good. Wait, so hold on, Dex Fowler, where is he? In the second spot tonight. Because he was our center fielder last season. I mean, I know he's gone, but I'll check for it later. I don't know. Whew. Got to give me some of them strikeouts, yo. There's that 83-mile-an-hour heat. Joe McDonald called a strike. Better fucking keep it up, too. I'll burn your farm down. See, now it's like accuracy's hitting like perfect. Like, what the hell? Perfect timing, perfect timing, perfect timing. Throw it! No, he said! This fucking game. This motherfucking game. I was trying to, like, be in motion while I was, you know, throwing. Because I know that's an issue. Ball that outside. I should have just made sure I had a step to fucking go. That motherfucker should be one out ball, this game. One strike. It's fucking bullshit programming. Ball, A little bit inside. of slop with this game. There really is. Ah. Two balls, two strikes. And that pitch was up high. Damn it. Better be foul. Jump to scale the wall. That hit the fucking cement railing, you know. Down chop. Well. Out. Can't allow a base hit here. Fuck. Batting four. Third baseman. Danny Valencia. Strike one. Would have been better if he just dribbled it to Rizzo. Gets himself out right away. Okay. Uh, I mean, late, late, late. What? I don't, I don't agree with it. It's so far down in the dirt. I missed my spot, but still. All right, all this curveball down shit. Late, 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 late. Foul, foul, foul. Come on. Luckily, he missed that cutter and we get out of the jam. Shit. Yeah, slow down, buddy. You can run to me by the base pad up. Mm -mm. Fly out. Nothing. Nothing. 
Todd Cope. Leading off for Oakland. Left fielder, Todd Cope. Ah. Ah. Oh, 01's the count. Get some stuff really, really rock and rolling here. Shot off the end of the bat. Didn't look great, but uh, fucking warning track. Jesus Christ. Sometimes they look like they're gone, and nope, it's just way up there. That one didn't even look like it hit the good part of the bat. Almost gone. Hey! Hey! Oh, you pretty little thing, you. You know, like, look at the one. movement on that pitch. Like, I don't need to really touch my movement. I don't. The count Control is probably one. needs a little bit of help. I admit that. Shit. Let's give me another ball. Let's give me another ball. They're not even looking for it. That was perfect timing, by the way. It's what I thought, but, uh, yep. Batting seven, second baseman. There was a faint Jen chant Lowry. in the crowd. I heard, throw it back, throw it back. Faint, I heard that. You might want to go and check on that yourself. All right, O2. Hey, here's the good spot for it. Damn, well, hey. No, somebody, somebody. All right, you. Way to go. Way to go. Batting eight. Catcher, Mariano Pina. Oh, oh, inside. Just didn't have enough break to it to come back in. Shit. But playable. Okay. Uh, again, guys, you got to bail me out on this one. One out. A hit. A hit. And bases are loaded for me with one out. All right, if it's there, I'm going first thing. Four seamer. Two seamer. Oh, fuck it. Braxton. Nope. Hey! It was the four seamer up. Two seamer up. Come on. Now oh, it's gonna be something down. Ball that's outside. Yes, missed outside. Okay, he but that was the two. Two up. Nope. Yeah! Damn it. Alright, a lot of fastballs. What's coming? Curveball. Nope. Nope, that's, that's a foul. circle swing. I'm just trying to stay alive with it. Two up. Ow. God Me damn too. it. God damn it. Yep, yeah, that was the tie run right there. Couldn't get him in time. So <sighs> Ball one, no fight. God damn it. <laughs> Can't even do that. I mean, he'll drop it. He's due. Damn it. Oh, that sucks. Base is loaded, one out. Leading off with the athletic. Shit. Petra. Jesse Hahn. You just kind of get that Dr. Evil kind of a sense. Shit. That's mm. a ball. One and one. Punch to second. Thank you, He's thank out. you. Get it all taken care of. Damn it. We had a great opportunity there, and I just the couldn't, couldn't get it done one. at the plate. Billy Burns. Couldn't fucking do it. Never hit the ground. One pitch, one out. Now batting. Shortstop. Manuel Andino. Why do this? Ball that's outside. I mean, especially with my cutter. 
If I had a separate pitch, which, yeah, yeah, again, somewhere in my brain that's still rattling, like, oh, you know what, I, I should Whoa, get a fourth pitch. pitch. I don't know what it would be, honestly. Down, chop, second, he's and out. he's gone. Getting over. Come on, guys. Bail me out here. I couldn't do it for myself. Lead off double. A walk. A shot that ties it up. Thank you. A shot that gives us the lead. A shot that gets insurance. That's a triple, so yeah, big time. That comes in. 5-1, to one, and I'm back up with my 190 batting average. That's fun. What did he throw last time? The pitcher. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. So there was a sinker down is what I chopped at. Uh, two up. Fuck it. No. Ball. There was two in. All right. Why not four out? Nope. That's ball two. All right, you got ripped off two there, kid. He did get ripped off. Four out. Nope. Aye. Sinker up. Odd. Fucking two up. Oh, yeah. Right to him. Right to him. God damn it. I almost want to dumb it down to, like, beginner batting because I'm not getting anything rocking here. And sometimes I feel like, okay, we got a healthy lead now, don't get me wrong. Hit by pitch with the bags juiced. My God. All right, so Dex is playing left. So what, Dex is getting rotated with, uh, with Schwarber, strangely enough. I mean, why not have Dex and Schwarber and then Hayward's in right? Because I don't know much about Anthony Goes. I really don't. All I know is I got an 8-1 fucking cushion right now. They need two grand slams to retake the lead. The that feels good here in the fourth inning. Mark Cannon. Ah! All one's the count. Oh, this one's a little bit snugging in on him. Ball inside. Didn't bring it back in enough. Can't do it. All right, I ain't doing that. Somebody get that, please. That's you, Riz. There you go. Now batting. Third baseman, Danny Valencia. So we're looking pretty good and poised right now for another W. Which would be the sixth on the year. Not all the numbers are great. I get that. And the batting looks like shit. Oh, center field blast. Running, running, running. Running. To the fucking Ivy. Whew. CBJ, our man Columbus is in the Up house. Welcome in Columbus to a late night live stream. Let's play of MLB The Show 16. As we are, well, we're we're into May of 2017, which would be my second year with this starting pitcher. This road to the show career of one Casey Braxton. Well, uh, Casey, uh, you gotta tell me, man, who you got in the Stanley Cup? Hey! They're tied up one to one in the series. Who do you got? Who do you got, man? Because suckers got to know. Nice catch there. Two pitch out. Done. You got the blues. All right. Now, is that just because you hate Boston because they're in the east and so is beloved Columbus? Suckers got to know. All right. So there's a man on second in my 182 batting average coming up. Because Boston is trash. Oh, Boston is trash, but yet they're in the Stanley Cup Final. What about your fucking Columbus, huh? Come on. They're not trash. If they got to the Stanley Cup Final, they're not trash. Tampa Bay won the President's Cup. Damn near had a record-setting year. Got swept in the opening round. That is more trash than anything in the playoffs so far. Even more than Pittsburgh, who would have had another Stanley Cup run here. But Tampa, you know they're good, though. But no, Boston ain't trash. You know they ain't trash. You're fucking pissed now off. Is your the team's not there. there. We're not Casey there. Braxton. Don't be one of those guys. Come on. Come on. You better than that. You better than that. Aye. It's been a good physical fucking two games. Well, I'll tell you that much. God damn. Aye. 
Guys just been beating the shit out of each other. Alright, so what the fuck is this? Change up low, change up low, sinker down. Nope. Pull shot. Hey, that's probably not a oh no no, I might get an RBI. I got an RBI. Not bad. Not bad. Good running. Good running. The second baseman number I didn't mean he is Tris. So I mean, red. because Boston beat up. Exactly. You're pissed off at the team that beat you. Just be honest about it. They ain't trash. Because that makes it sound like trash just beat you. You know what I mean? No, nah, if you want to say, well, there was a couple of cheap shots and penalties didn't get called. and You can bring that stuff into the mix. But if a team beats you and you think they're trash, that doesn't say good for your team. Remember hey. that. You have to hype them up a little bit. I mean, hell, I can go back. Ah, uh, uh, shit, I forgot what year exactly. I think it was the second Stanley Cup that the Kings won. They beat the Blackhawks. I want to say it was Game 7. It was definitely an overtime win. They beat the Hawks. It might have been the Western Conference Final. But I was up visiting my family at the time, and I was just fucking drunk as shit at that point. Me and my brother sitting there watching. It goes to overtime, and like we're like, motherfucking Corey Crawford. God damn it, you know. Always blame the goalie, right? But I was all fucking just, uh, just really hammered the rest of the night, just all sloppy drunk. And then whatever, a week or so later, it's like, all right, well, the Kings won the Stanley Cup. I was more mad at the Hawks for losing than I was the Kings for, like, beating Chicago. But then the, the Kings go and win the Cup, and I'm like, hey, we lost to the best fucking team in the league. They had to get through us to go win that shit, but it was no pushover. So for that, I was kind of like, all right, if there's any bit of solace, like, okay... The best team in the league beat us in route to get there. It's like there's a little bit of, one dare I say, pride to that. I mean, shit, I'm, I'm think of Tampa Bay right now. Like I said, using them as an example. Aye. Had nearly a record-setting year. President's Cup winner swept in the first fucking round. I'm not saying that's never happened, but right, that was pretty monstrous. Like, that's Jason bad. Hayward. And that's a really good fucking team. But you can't say a, you can't say a four-game sweep is a fluke or nothing like that. You just can't. It's not a fluke. And Pittsburgh got their ass swept by the Islanders. Four straight games is not a fluke. Something was working right. And again, Pittsburgh. I would have lost so much money just on that alone. Pittsburgh and Tampa getting not just ousted in the opening round, but swept. I mean, you, you would have had to give me, like, 10,000 to 1 odds, and I'd be like, all right, here's 10 bucks. <laughs> Might have done more, though. Oh. What do we got? That has never happened. Uh, you made franchise and NHL history. Yeah, dude, I mean, President's Cup swept in the opening round, and, and they were damn near close to, like, a single-season record for... Uh, like win points or some shit like that. Very close to that Detroit team. Leading yeah, off whatever that was, early millennium. Right fielder. I mean, they were Rich damn close to Ayala. breaking that fucking record. Like wins in a season or, or you know, oh and one points, some shit like that. They were really high up there on the fucking list. Eight, As Bruce two. Pritchard would say, easily top five. I need some fucking strikeouts today, huh? Not a ball nearly hitting my foot. And this son of a bitch getting a base up the middle. God damn it. God damn it. Now batting. Well, let's get a Second double baseman. play so this doesn't hurt as much. Jed Lowry. Well. Get off the plate. I'll hit you in the fucking chin. Annihilate you. Pull shot. God damn it. Well, that's no good. Oh my god, you dumb fucks. Uh, why did you try such an aggressive throw and how did you not reel it in? The catcher number two. Wow. Mariano Pina. Wow. Does everybody understand why I really want that fucking uh, your teammates will not commit any errors fucking perk? I mean, that means I need to work up my BB9 to like 85 or whatever the fuck. But that's, that's the fucking reason why. Number that shit won't happen. Yonder Alonso. And I know we're up nine to one. Still, they don't need to get any more runs. 
because that's just fucking bullshit, the game trying to get them back into it like that. Oh my no god. Ball, two strikes. Yep, that's fun too. Call for a pitch down low and then you can't sit on it. When this game doesn't want you to do good, you won't. Just hit this fucking guy. Yeah, so that way I can get the double play going. Yeah, right? I, already, I don't give a fuck that I already won. I don't. <laughs> There's no excuse for us being that kind of shitty. Doing that kind of bullshit errors and getting people Ball advanced. Inside. Catcher wants a pitch down low. Can't fucking sit on it. Run comes in. We caught it. That's good. Jesus fucking Christ. Now batting. Center fielder. Yeah, 14 game Billy hitting streak. Burn. Skipper, you want to come out here and start talking to me? Cool me the fuck down, because this game's just being cheap as shit. Hey! This is like Dollar Tree cheap right here, okay? That's how fucking bullshit cheap this is. Oh, two is the count. Keep in mind, one out, and I've been saying, oh yeah, we'll get a double play here. That'll get us out of the inning. One ball, two strikes, the count. Yeah, that double play that I wanted was uh, two runs ago. I got the count. Two and two. Solid shot to center. Please be there. Oh, there you go. Easy on the throw here, kiddo. Yeah, thankfully I'm... Uh, yeah, at least I'm there for that one, huh? Now Last time I didn't expect Short fucking... Manuel Hayward to throw that him. shit all the way to third. That wildly. No cutoff man, no nothing. Just straight nope. throw to third. Ball one. And nearly put it in the fourth row. Hey! One ball, two strike. Uh, damn it. <sighs> two, two, the count. I'll just fucking skip it off. Damn it. Perfect timing. Gets a hold. Wrong pitch. You ain't running. You ain't running. Wait, what? Has what a what yet? <laughs> I'll let that one slide. All right, out there in left field. Hey, the catch, no error. He didn't drop it. That's fun. Thanks, everybody. Yeah, two errors, and they got two runs in that inning. Hmm, coincidence? I think not. Base hit, walk, strikeout, and strikeout. I'll be the number two batter, if they so let me play. Has Baez bad? Yeah, he's had to. Wait, wait, wait. Baez. Mark. Let me check for that. Uh, let's go batter and Wait, player stats, excuse me. I'll switch teams here. Uh, yes, Baez has batted. I don't know what he's done today, but, uh, he has. Yeah, I think we've gone in the order at least one set. Probably two sets. I don't know. Oh, shit. I don't know where this was supposed to go. Hey! I fucked it up. I fucked it up. I don't know about that curveball. I, I just don't know about that specific curveball. I normally make a note of what the fuck I'm doing before I pause the game like that. Ball that down Let's just be safe and say it was curveball down. Because they'll never call for a curveball like up here. They never will. Never fucking will. Well, he... Like an under-sweep fucking cut. They had to reach out to get under it. No power. No power. Speaking of, I now need more it. strikeouts. Third baseman, Danny Valencia. He a lot more strikeouts. Ball. Yeah, so imagine that. Now that I raised my H9 to, what is that, 85. Limit solid yeah. contact. And then we just start causing fucking errors left and right. Oh, sorry. Oh, bad throw. Yep. Oh, down in the dirt, this thing. Wild pitch. Oh, it's gone. That's great. 
Home runs just flying out now. Well, it wasn't a perfect timing pitch, but it was again a cutter. And I've let by four fucking runs today. That's the bullshit of this fucking game. See how quickly that, you know, they get the jump back. Oh, Mike, you're up 8-1, to 9-1. to one. Oh, yeah, that's shit, this is in the bag. No, this game will just dick you over. Yeah, solid shot. I'll dive for it. Here, let's rip my pectoral muscle. We'll have to restart the fucking game. Let's do that, huh? Now and this fucking cocksmack had a home run on a perfect timing pitch, mind you. Another solid shot. Okay, but not deep enough. Raptors won, huh? All right. Yeah, I saw that there was like five minutes left. They were up like 103 to 9. I don't know. I'm up about 10 points. Can't say I'm shocked. I mean, I'll give them a game or two. Jed Lowry. But see, they're already doomed. Okay, it just happens. It's so cyclical in sports. We want an underdog until they become a juggernaut, right? That counts. One and one. Like when Golden State first won, everybody's like, holy shit, you know, this is great. Changing in the guard. It was a new team. Look at that. I can't keep anything in the fucking zone now. That's gone. That's gone. Great. Great. Yeah, throw my controller up to hit the ceiling. Yeah. Motherfucking great. See? Now we're only up by three. Mariano. I, I just want to throw the controller like into the fucking TV and just break everything. Like a lot. Oh, and this game is so fucking like five dollar DVD, DVD bin at Walmart cheap. Oh yeah, and you're gonna bitch about that fucking strikeout? Go fuck your mother. God damn is this game cheap. Yeah, just pin shit for my fucking ass. I'm not doing shit now. Oh, 14 to 11. Wow, this game kind of got interesting. Four RBI and two runs scored for Russell. Good for him, honestly. This is fucking bullshit cheap. Got my sixth win. Look at that shit. Six, dude, I'm telling you. I didn't have all those earned, like, in the fifth inning. Sorry, that was errors. That shit ain't earned against me. Uh-uh. Well, they were runners on bait, yeah, but some fucking slap dick named Hayward can't do shit. Stranded second single, 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 where the fuck was all that? Three pitch home run, one run, three pitch home run, two run score. Jesus Christ. Home run there, what the fuck? Fielding error in the first fucking inning? Wow, I must have missed that one. Oh, back to back in it. Wait, whoa, whoa. Fielding error, three pitch error. Is that where that all went down? No, like that shit happened in the fifth inning. Single, single, pop out. Five pitch double with a run. Line out. Fly out, fly. Uh, no, no. The errors were in the fifth, dude. I'm sorry. If they happened in the first, I, I don't believe that. Fielding error in the first. I honestly don't remember that shit. What the fuck is this game trying to jerk me around with? Well, we get the win. Oh, wait, wait. I gotta do my switch and save here. Just in case. Alright, beginner. You know what? Honestly, I'm going to go batting to beginner. Because I ain't doing shit on rookie. And my, my numbers are all zero. I'm going to put it on beginner. Okay, just for, just to get that shit going a little bit. I'm going to save now. i got to simulate up to my next game. God damn it. 118-109 the final. The Raptors over the Warriors. But, oh, I was saying about that. Like, when the Warriors had their first win, this most recent win. I know they won back in the day. Like in the 70s or some shit. But, um... This most recent run, when they started winning, it was, like, kind of cute, and, like, it was a changing of the guard. And everybody's like, yeah, this team's awesome, I love them, I love them. But now, because they keep winning, now we're starting to hate them. But I'm saying Toronto is already doomed, because Drake likes them. So, and if anything, I'm not saying it's going to be a fluke. Toronto, well, pitching, goes to veteran. Toronto has been a very consistent, always going to the playoffs kind of a team. But just because of Drake, 
I honestly think that's where they're doomed to where no one's going to even give a shit about them. It's not going to be, yay, there's a new team that takes the throne and, like, knocks off this juggernaut. Part of me hopes that they do win, but they're already fucked from the start. Just because of Drake. Simple as that. Oh, this is what I need right here. Oh, smooth hands. Uh, unlock at 85. Yeah, that's what I need. I need my teammates to not commit a fucking error out there. Only thing is, I need 7,465 points to make that shit even possible. For smooth hands. Are you kidding me? Goddamn, goddamn disgusting. I could get good pitching clutch there. What is this, 90? This is what, 2,300 points right here? That's, Jesus, that's so smooth. The Raptors are good. They have a more physical game. That's the best chance that they'll have, in my opinion. But do I even put stamina to 70? I don't know. I think stamina is fine right now where we're sitting. Just glad we are not facing the Cavs again. Well, dude, this is the first time in how many years that the finals does not have LeBron James in it? I mean, four years with Miami. And then what? They lose when Iguodala was MVP. Then they had the 3-1 the to one comeback. And then they lost two in a row. Eight years in a row that man goes to the finals. And people, well, he's not as good as this. He's not as good as Jordan. He's not, dude, I'm, I'm telling you, okay? Ugh. Michael Jordan should have gone to eight straight finals, maybe more. But baseball, this, that, the other, fine. You know, his heart wasn't it. He was the best player on the floor even when he was 40 years old. And I get that, but the level of player now is far greater like, you have to be so fucking good right now to dominate the way LeBron does. And sure, it's a generational thing. So you can't compare, you know, Babe Ruth to Barry Bonds. You can't because it's in your generation, you are the best. But there, there's so much rolling in LeBron's favor. He went, he's gone to eight straight finals. And he finally got hurt this year. The man was never fucking hurt. <laughs> you know? He was never hurt and played all those playoffs. By the time... Okay, eight straight years going to the finals. Even if you sweep every fucking series, and we know he didn't, but that's, uh, well, just quick math here. That'll be four series, and that's an extra 16 games per year. So on top, and I know he didn't play exactly 82 games the whole fucking run, but eight years times an extra 16 games minimum is an extra 128 games that he played. In perfect sweeps, all the way through first, second uh, conference and finals round. We know that never happened. The minimum that he played in eight straight years going to the finals is 128 extra games more than anybody else. That's freakish. That's fucking unheard of. So, like, oh, yeah, it's good thing it's not the Cavs. Well, just any LeBron team, pretty much. Because... Christ's sakes, I, I don't think pe people shit on him way too much. I'm like, dude, he is the measuring bar. We don't even know who's in second place. Kevin Durant has been gone for so long, and Golden State still looks like they're going to win the championship without him. And everybody said he's the second best player in the league. Let that sink in. LeBron is hurt with the Lakers. They still don't make the playoffs. I mean, who the real MVP? Who the real MVP? Just a question. And Russell Westbrook, for all his triple-doubles, third year in a row, he averages a triple-double for the regular season, and the third year in a row, he gets ousted in the opening round, the opening round of the playoffs. I laugh at stuff like that, I really do. I'm not a fan of his, obviously, but, uh, like, that's a guy who doesn't make the team better. He's a good stat compiler, but that's about it. Gotten to think he, Durant, and Harden were all on the same team when they were young. If they would have all stayed there, for fuck's sakes. Well, no, because Harden doesn't pass, and Westbrook wouldn't want to pass, so Durant would get less. It's like, God, they didn't they didn't realize how good they could have had it, dude. Oklahoma could have won, like, ten straight titles. <laughs> and Durant's a really good fucking defender, despite the other two. Anyway quick setup here next time we play the live stream let's play of mlb the show 16 as we follow this road of the show career of one casey braxton we are still somehow undefeated despite that cheap cheap fucking game 14 to 11 bullshit against oakland we will be at cincinnati one two three four five one at arizona two three four 
one and uh hosting pittsburgh we will jump into the month of june the next time we roll in just a quick look down the line of things uh awards i mean i don't think i'll be up for anything mvp rizzo really hold on one second here we're a half game behind we're not doing incredibly well i'd like to say our run scored is through the fucking roof 229 nobody else in the goddamn division has 200 runs allowed see yeah we're letting by too many of that shit other than the game that i just fucking had there with oakland i've been doing really well with uh not allowing many runs. But of course, then again, if I get pulled in the 6th, 7th, 8th inning and the bullpen lets by a bunch. But I'd like to think that I personally, outside of that game I just played, my runs allowed has been pretty, pretty low. But yeah, almost 200 runs. We need it. We need that lower. That's going to make all the difference. 6 and 4 in the last 10, 15 and 8 in the division. Mm, no one's really doing good in the division right now. Which is odd. So we're kind of. We're kind of cannibalizing ourselves anyway league leaders um i don't know i was looking at awards well. let's look through all of it really quick cy young i'm not on that list god damn it that was my hope reliever rookie well i'm no longer a rookie hank aaron gold glove not gonna be me not as a pitcher silver slugging pitcher yeah i don't have home runs i ain't got but one rbi god damn it um that's about it fuck there's nothing that i'm near I think I was number two in the Cy Young when I last looked. But oh well, that's no big deal. Um, do, 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 league leaders. Uh, wins, I mean, I got six. Which is second best. Braxton, there we go. Losses, still nothing. Boy, this guy has one extra inning pitched more than me. So he's actually doing pretty good. And he plays for fucking Colorado. That's insane, oh. Losses, I don't get saves. ERA jumped a little bit here, too, some odd. Uh, yeah, 242, son of a bitch. Tenth best in the National League. I yeah, guess that, that game right there just blew me up. Home runs allowed, uh, it's gonna be more than I want it to be. It's gotta be six or some odd. Where's my number? Home runs seven with 17 earned. 17 earned runs in however many innings, goddammit. Seven, that's way too much. Shutouts, nope, I don't have that. You know why? Because I ain't got complete games. Strikeouts, I didn't see that number either, but I didn't do great on this set. I really didn't. Strikeout 60? Yeah, see, I'm not near the list here. Jesus, Jose. You're throwing like a cokehead. Too soon? Uh, completed games? I don't even think I have... I might have one. Innings pitched, well, what if I have 60 strikeouts? Yeah, I should have looked. Well, I know I have a little crown icon by me. 63 and a third. I, I want to be an innings horse that gets a lot of strikeouts. Walks allowed, one walk allowed. And I beam somebody. But it's not really allowing a walk. It's a hit batsman. But still. Um, whip. Oh, I lost my whip trophy. Son of a bitch. This guy's 73 innings pitched with a 0.73 whip. Good for him. Jesus Christ. I mean, that's impressive. That really is. Pitching war. What's my 189, 183? 12th best. Yeah, I mean, the strikeouts aren't there. The ERA kind of jumped a little bit for me. I don't get the strikeouts these, du these dudes are getting. Damn it. Still 183. I'd be pretty good here in the National League. Or sorry, in the American League. Who? Yeah, they got Chris Sale and fucking Steven Strasburg here in the White Sox. That's kind of dangerous. 28 years old, 28 years old. Keep them both. White Sox, if you're smart, keep them both. That's going to be murderous. Speaking of uh, other divisions, let's get a jump around there. AL East, Red Sox lead it by 3.5 over the Blue Jays. Orioles are 4.5 back. Rays are 10 back. Yankees are 10.5 back. Didn't see that coming. Um, especially with that pie chart. No contact, but good pitching. Hmm. Pitching and contact. That's a good combo. Power's good to have, but so long as you get on base, you got good pitching. Uh, in the Central, Indians lead it. 
two games over the Royals. The White Sox are five and a half back. Now look at that, 180, 180. They're just not hitting the ball. Uh, Tigers are six back in the division. Twins, eight back in the division. AL West, Astros lead it by a half game over the Rangers. Angels are three and a half back. Athletics, four and a half back. Mariners, six and a half back. Fuck the wild card. The Mets own the NL East by seven games over the Braves. Nationals are seven and a half back. Marlins, 15 and a half back. Phillies, 18 games back. Ouch. NL Central. Cardinals are leading us by a half game. Pirates are a game and a half back. Reds, seven and a half back. Brewers, nine and a half back. And in the West, the Rockies own it right now. Half game over the Dodgers, uh, over the Giants, excuse me. Dodgers are five games back. Arizona's five and a half back. And the Padres, nine and a half games back. If there were a wild card, I don't play that game. It's not even fucking, it's not even the all-star break. Anyway, yeah, we got Cincinnati, Arizona, and Pittsburgh. That will be for the next time. Quick shout out to everybody who jumped in. Nick Carrington uh, and our man, CBJFan1125. I call him Columbus. But thanks so much for checking everything out here live on the Twitch side of things. If you watch episodically on YouTube at your own leisure, that was a cheap game against Oakland. But oh well. Swig of water for the gamer guys and girls out there. Uh-huh. Ah, it's fucking tasty. And all that being said, MJ signing out for now. Till we meet again, everybody. I don't know when or where that's exactly going to take place, and I'm not sure what game we'll be playing the next time you and I cross paths specifically, but all I do know is that I will indeed catch you down the road.